Let's build a bear with dead bodies. Hello. I got a pearl for Emily as an early anniversary present that my mom got for me to give. <laughs> San Diego. In uh, San Diego, she got or it. San Francisco. San Francisco. No, San Diego, I think. And um, it's our it's our anniversary gift to you. You two months early. Yes, it's only two months. <laughs> okay, pull okay. ring and she's gonna open the oyster. Has your sister opened hers yet? No. Well, that's great. We're gonna see if it smells bad. I don't think it will smell bad. Because it's dead. Oh there it is. Does it smell? It smells like chemicals, like formaldehyde, like mm -hmm. preserved taste. Oh, so it is preserved stuff. And Your mom said you can do the part where it, you clean it out. <laughs> yeah. So you have to clean out the flesh. You're there's, a, there's a pearl in there. You're not, no, no, no. I'm going to use this. No, you're not. To crack you're not, it open. How do you get it out of there? No. I think you can peel it open. Use a hands. butter knife or a little knife or something. Yeah, do we have a plastic it. knife? I don't know. We gotta dump out the liquid. I don't think is a plastic knife strong enough. I don't know. I didn't know if you wanted us to use a butter knife. Pocket knife? Do you have a pocket knife? No, not with me. You can probably pop it open yourself. It's an oyster. Yes, it's coming apart actually. It probably, yeah, with the chemicals. Be careful, I don't want the pearl to do it on the thing. Oh, yeah. <laughs> well, that would kind of stink. This thing was alive, and I'm just peeling it apart. Ugh. It's dead carcass. Eh. It's cracking. Yeah, it's coming apart. It peels off. You can just pull it. I guess we're going to peel it apart. It must be because it's in that chemical solution. It probably eats away yeah. at it. Ah. It looks like you can just pull it wide open now. Oh, I'm right? afraid it's gonna cut oh, me. Okay. Let me Did it cut you? No. Do you see it? Ew, that's nasty. I see dude. it, I think. I think it's a white one. What? They Ew. said if it, there's no pearl in there, you can get refunded. Ew. There is, yeah, that's oyster parts. That's an actual animal. Ew. Oh, there it is. There's its innards. That's kind of cool. Oh, is it white or cream color? It's. it's in this body. It's, oh, it's a cream, I think. Cream color. <gasps> That's pretty. They said white's the most common. Look <laughs> at the dead body. That's, uh, so, that's kind of cool, though. I've never seen a real pearl inside an oyster before. <laughs> that is disgusting. <laughs> Should I stop filming now? I guess. You putting your pearl on? Eh. Uh, it's hard to get on. Is it working? The thing won't peel back, babe. There. There's two of you. There it is. It's pretty. I like it a lot. It's like my new favorite necklace. Thank you, baby. Mm -hmm. Awkward to pearl. Okay. We're done. We need to go clean up. Earlier we were um, shopping for books for Emily. And she got some books for her summer class. And, um, yeah, my mom got back from California, and my sister and her boyfriend are here at, in town. And we had to unload a huge U-Haul full of stuff and put it in our basement. Luckily, we had enough space. And, um... That was fun. Emily's making a hot pocket right now. So that's why I'm alone and vlogging more. And I got a frozen iced frozen hot chocolate or iced hot chocolate something from Dunkin' Donuts. And there it is. It's like it's darker like a chocolate drink. That's Emily's Frappuccino, and um, 
Yeah, it's really good. It tastes like a milkshake that's more watered down, like a melted milkshake. It's amazing. And I'm over at Emily's house right now, so that's fun. And I don't know what we're going to do, but might play video games or watch TV. I bet you're wondering why I have a machete and where I got it from. Well, I got it for my birthday from, uh, my sister's boyfriend bought it for me because I said I wanted, like, some kind of knife because they were in a Chinatown and I'm like, they have knives in Chinatown, but this one was actually from Walmart and it was five dollars. So they just got it for me. And they sharpened it themselves with a wet stone. The edge is pretty dull. Like, you can rub it against your clothes and it won't cut. <laughs> and, um, yeah. It's just like a for show knife right now. Because maybe I'll sharpen it more because I like to clear brush out of my backyard a lot. And... I'll sharpen it and use it as a brush clearing device, and that'll be fun. Don't tell Emily I told you this, but she's terrified of this. I gotta go. She's back.